Welcome back. Ryan Hemmel is a legal technology professional from Los Angeles, California. Most of us became fans watching Jeopardy. You had another way of becoming a fan. Yeah, that's correct. Uh, so when I was in high school, my friends and I would get together every weekend and play the Jeopardy video game. And that's actually how I know a lot of the stuff that I do these days, just from playing that, you know, countless hours. <laughs> Very cool. Karen Farrell is a political consultant from Chesapeake, Virginia, and you used your winnings to renovate your kitchen and master bath? Yeah, that's right. So we moved this past year, and since we had a little bit of money and wanted to do something fun with it, we decided that we would uh, get the kitchen and the master bath in our house fixed up a bit, knocked down a couple walls in the master bath, got some new appliances and counters in the kitchen, so it, it's really nice to get up every morning and see what my winnings bought me. Exactly, a good reminder of your success on the show every day. Sam Cavanaugh is a substitute teacher originally from Carleton, Minnesota, and your third episode ran during a family reunion? Yeah, uh, so my dad had 12 brothers and sisters, um, wow. Irish Catholic, uh, <laughs> and they were all gathered around and at the same time, and for some reason, one of them thought that I was going to lose that game, and so they kept coming up to me and saying, you know, it's, you did really well, and you should be really proud. I'm like, you know, I am. <laughs> <laughs> little did they know, little did they know. All right, Karen, you gave us the last correct response, so please pick the next clue. Let's do something you can ride for 600.